Welcome to the age of agentic AI, where we use generative artificial intelligence to get real world things done, be it in your professional world or in your personal life. Uh, we start with your favorite foundational model, and I'm sure you already played with at least one or several of them, the JetGPTs, Claude's, Gemini's of the world, and then we personalize them, uh, giving them some expertise or some skill and that basically consists in learning how to talk with them luckily we don't need to know Python or some kind of coding they talk plain English I sometimes speak with them in three different languages within one sentence and it's totally fine they are large language models this language things they have that figured out and what we do here is with, with basically with prompt engineering as we give them a specific skill or expertise I often compare it to when we here at the University of California get a student with a high school degree, then we take the time to convert them into well, some kind of professional, a, a data scientist, a project manager, or a tax accountant. And that you can do with prompting. That is often good enough for, for, for many of these specialization tasks. And then you have somebody who is well, much more an expert and that's much more useful to have than to have a generalist. But as most of us who worked in the real world for a day or two know, just having somebody with a very good training is not good enough to get the job done. <laughs> so here we need some contextualization when you train somebody on the job that has to do with processes, giving them routines, giving them workflows. And that's what we call agents, AI agents, agentic AI. So we connect them basically to the real world. We give them access to some tools, a social media API, or a database, or allow them to do a web search. And we also use them to figure out their own way. We give them autonomy in how they can solve a problem. And this is extremely powerful, but can also get very fast very complex and unpredictable, so we'll have to talk about that. That comes with AI agent workflows. Now, now you have a professional on the job who can get most of the jobs done quite efficiently, but for the really hard problems, the really difficult ones, one worker is actually not enough. What you need there is an entire team, and the technical term here is orchestration to build multi-agent systems, and that's the reason why we create teams and companies, systems. So you have different complementarity, the division of labor. You can tackle difficult problems like hallucination, for example. Hallucination might be a trait in order to be more creative, but then you also want to have a fact checker on the side. But also many other challenges, for example, the hard ones, the robustness, the reliability of the system. Many of them you can tackle much better with, with having a team. And that's the reason we also create teams in the real world. And the result is here that you basically become a human resource manager of these multi-agent systems. Oh no, sorry. Um, no, you become a non-human AI resource manager of multi-agent systems. And it becomes as complex as managing a company yourself, but you will have this, well, army of, of one, this army of AI agents behind you in order to take decisions and that really comes with many, many benefits. The same benefits, the difference between you working by yourself or having the entire team behind you. And in this course, we will tackle that in five modules. After the big picture overview, we will talk about personalization, giving generative AI some skills, basically through good old prompt engineering. We will then talk about creating AI agent workflows, giving them tools, get, having them, giving them the possibility to get things done. Fourth, the orchestration in multi-agent systems. And finally, we will also have to talk about some of the limitations, some of the critiques, and some of the ethical considerations that come with releasing AI agents into the wild. I'm very much looking forward to going on this exploration together with you.